Starship Flight 10, a giant leap for SpaceX and the future of space travel. In a triumphant display of engineering and perseverance, SpaceX successfully launched its 10th integrated flight test of the Starship Super Heavy system on August 26, 2025, from the Starbase facility in South Texas. This milestone marks a pivotal moment in the development of the world's most powerful and fully reusable rocket, designed to carry humans to the moon, Mars, and beyond. Its purpose is bold, routine, rapid, and reusable access to deep space, a launch that defied the odds. After a series of delays due to technical issues and weather setbacks, Starship Flight 10 lifted off at 7.30 p.m. EDT, igniting excitement across the globe. The launch followed three previous failed attempts earlier in the year, each ending in the loss of the upper stage vehicle. But Flight 10 broke the streak, achieving a clean liftoff and executing key mission objectives. Lessons learned, systems refined. SpaceX's journey to Flight 10 has been anything but smooth. Failures and a ground explosion in June Space prompted deep investigations and design overhauls. The FAA officially cleared Booster SpaceX for Flight 10 after closing its probe, signaling confidence in the company's improvements. For Flight 10, SpaceX deployed Ship 37 and Booster 16, both upgraded to withstand the rigors of ascent and descent. The rocket lit and climbed, a spectacle of power and precision. The Super Heavy Booster executed a controlled splashdown in the Gulf of Mexico, while the upper stage aimed for a propulsive splashdown in the Indian Ocean. Controlled splashdowns are critical tests for future lunar missions and reusability. Ship 37 and Booster 16 were configured to survive the stresses of ascent and descent, mission objectives and achievements. Flight 10 was a full systems test with several key goals. Deployment of eight Starlink satellite mass simulators, these mass simulators validate deployment dynamics ahead of real payloads. In-space engine reignition was a priority to prove maneuverability in orbit. Successful reignition paves the way for orbital refueling and translunar injection. Controlled splashdowns of both stages were tested and monitored closely. Recovery data informs rapid turnaround and refurbishment workflows. Testing of new heat shield configurations on Ship 37 evaluated re-entry survivability. These improvements are essential for crewed lunar re-entry profiles. What this means for the future. SpaceX has set ambitious goals, including launching up to 24 times in a single day by the early 2030s. While that vision may still be years away, Flight 10 represents a major step toward making rapid, reusable spaceflight a reality. With Mars missions and lunar landings on the horizon, Flight 10 is more than a technical win. It's a symbol of humanity's expanding reach into the cosmos.